In the upcoming elections, President Emerson Unengogwa anticipates devouring the divided opposition, confirming past rumors about the competitive advantage a single, united opposition alliance will have over the ruling ZNU-PF party. Political parties once welcomed the notion in 2018, which led to the founding of the MDC alliance, which suffered another split shortly after the elections, in an effort to calm tensions within the opposition camp. Speaking to party members in Chapinga over the weekend, Umningogwa exposed the enormous financial potential provided by the divided opposition. While other parties remain divided, ZANU PF will continue to rule Zimbabwe. The ruling party differs from other organizations that encourage and seek foreign intervention in domestic issues. The ruling party was popular because it sought domestic answers to the problems facing the nation. In the management and governance of the nation, we leave no one behind. The symbol of ZANU PF is thus. We salute our steadfast cadres who support the party in good times and bad. We make our own decisions for the benefit of our nation and our people. We are devoted to the people of Zimbabwe, he stated. In his most recent book, Leaving So Many Behind, The Connection Between Politics and the Economy. Renowned economist Dr. Godfrey Kenyans traced some of the country's deep-seated issues and identified fragmentation as a retroactive component. The National Constitutional Assembly's decision to become a political party on September 28, 2013, after having been a part of the vibrant social movement of the late 1990s and having contributed to the formation of the MDC, was a significant development that indicated the separation of the MDCT from its social base. The book states, in part, that, meanwhile, the post-election self-introspection within the main opposition party MDCT produced disunity within the party. According to the document, Mangoma then counseled Morgan Svengerai, the then president of the MDCT, to resign in order to promote leadership renewal. Unfortunately, according to Kenyans, even the breakaway parties that split from the MDCT continued to split along the road, weakening the opposition movement even further. Zimbabwe Elections Commission ZEC recognized the existence of 75 political groups contesting elections up from 35, a scenario that depicts a fractured opposition. He added, by the time the 2018 elections were convened, this number had increased to 35. Ten presidential contenders are expected to form a part of the opposition forces opposing the ruling party in Zimbabwe as the country gets ready for its upcoming elections.